Flask's popularity has been growing lately, as the latest Stack Overflow developer survey shows. It even managed to overtake Django in the rating of the most popular frameworks. But even despite the fact that a lot of people like Flask, there aren't many good resources to learn it. That's why good books teaching you how to work with this Python framework are especially valuable. My name is Daniel, and today I will introduce you to top 3 Flask books. From beginner level to advanced. Let's start. Flask Web Development – Developing Web Applications with Python And the first book I want to talk about is really popular. When it comes to Flask. It goes into a lot of detail about important aspects of web development with a strong focus on Flask. Flask Web Development book helps beginners to learn Flask from scratch. Even if you don't know anything about this framework, you can become really good at it in a reasonable amount of time. There is something you have to keep in mind. This book is for Flask beginners. But it's not an easy one. You will find it much easier to read if you already know some Python. That's why if you are ready for a challenge and are willing to put in the effort, this book is ready to help you become confident in using Flask. And if you take a peek inside, you will see the book content is broken down into three main sections. The first section is all about Flask fundamentals. This is where you set up, adjust and learn the basic parts of the framework. You will quickly figure out how to use a database, do unit tests, manage passes, templates and many other important things you need to know for Flask development. In the second part you will learn how to create your own social blogging app. The app actually is quite up to date. You will cover the basics of user authentication, getting information from a database and even dive into building RESTful APIs. The final third section of the book is about putting your project online and making it secure. There aren't as many chapters in this section, but they are quite long. The topics include testing, making your app perform well, deploying it and finding more helpful resources. The author Miguel Greenberg is a software engineer who has been working in the field for more than 25 years. He runs a blog where he writes a lot about web development, Python, JavaScript, robotics and much more. So why do I like this book? Folks, if you are already good at Python and want to start using framework like Flask, I strongly suggest this book. The book provides a lot of valuable information if you are willing to put in the effort. I highly suggest it as a resource of learning Flask framework, because it covers a wide range of topics for beginners. Also, I have to say it does rely on third-party platforms a lot. But using this can save you a lot of time compared to creating your own solution. It's detailed enough to teach you the important parts, but also easy enough for beginners getting started with Flask. Alright, and now time to move on to the next book. The new and improved Flask Mega Tutorial. Guys, before I continue, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you like the content I make. It simply helps my channel grow. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell, so you don't miss my new videos. And the second book on this list is by the same author as the first one, Miguel Greenberg. It's an extensive guide for people who have some experience with Python. It teaches you how to do web development using Flask framework. Guys, I have to say, this book doesn't just focus on Flask. It also talks about many other things that Python developers should understand when they create their own projects. Alright, this book will guide you through a real web development project from the beginning to the end. Do you have any experience with Python and know basics of Flask? Then you should be able to use this book to learn how to create your own web applications using Python and Flask. The tutorial assumes that you know how to use the command line on your computer. Probably you are already aware about it. But still, if you are not familiar with it, I suggest learning how to do things like running programs, making folders and copying files using command line before you start. If you have already learned Flask, this update edition will introduce you to new Flask features. It will also provide you with fresh insights into important topics like authentication, full-text search and internationalization. Besides the updated content, this version of the tutorial includes new chapters that cover topics that have become important recently. By the way, there is also a course on Udemy based on this book. And it will be a good idea to use both the book and this course while learning. I left a link in the description. Why did I choose this book? I like this book because it guides you from the beginning idea all the way to creating a strong application that can be used in the cloud. The project shown in the book is something you can use in real life. 
It's like a simple website with features like login, logout and user profiles. The author explains all the steps really well and he doesn't expect you to already know something. Everything in the book is helpful from beginning to the end. It's all useful and relates to what is happening right now. Alright guys, and now it's time for the last book for today. Flask Framework Cookbook This is an updated second edition of the Flask Framework Cookbook. Now uses the latest Flask and Python 3 versions. It moves away from old and outdated libraries. Instead, it introduces new recipes that involve cutting-edge technologies. Throughout this Flask Python book, you will explore different ways to use Flask for creating, deploying and managing microservices. It begins by discussing the various configurations that Flask app can use. After that, it goes into working with templates and understanding the ORM and view layers. You will also learn how to create an admin interface and become skilled at finding and fixing errors through debugging and logging. In the end, the book covers a range of development and post-development methods for platforms like Apache, Tornado and Heroku. Once you have finished reading this book, you will have much more knowledge and confidence to write Flask applications and scale them up using industry standard practices. If you are a web developer and you want to discover how to make adaptable and ready-to-use apps with Flask, this book is for you. It's also helpful if you already know about Flask's important add-ons and want to use them to make your apps better. Keep in mind that this book is for more advanced developers, who already have experience with Python and Flask. Here you will learn advanced methods for templates and organizing data, how to deal with problems, keep records and handle errors well in Flask. Connect Flask with other technologies like Redis, Sentry and MongoDB. Put your Flask apps on the internet using Docker and Kubernetes and create a setup projects using AWS Lambda and a system of continuous integration and deployment. Author The author of this book has over 10 years of experience in creating and managing computer systems for businesses, as well as making websites and mobile apps for both small and big companies. He began his career using Python and he still loves being a Python developer. He's really interested in open source technologies and writes code that's easy to read and high quality. That's why no matter if you want to start learning Flask or need specific guidance, this book is an incredibly useful and informative resource. If you just flip through its pages, you will find that the author provides direct solutions to many real-world problems. It's written in a clear and straightforward way, because the author has a really smart way of organizing the book. It's easy to follow with great examples, he teaches new ideas by building a real app together with you. Alright, my fellow developers, and that's my list of the three best books on Flask today. No matter if you're a beginner or advanced Flask developer, you can benefit at least from one of these books. Guys, I left all the links to these books in the description. Check them out and select the one that suits you best. As always, please remember to like, subscribe and click the notification bell. Thanks for watching, until next time.